Hi, this is Gary from Cheetah Transformation, and this is the 30th Smartsheet Quick Tip on how to calculate the number of working days between two dates using Network Days formula. In this video, I'll be showing you how to calculate the number of working days between two dates utilizing the Network Days formula. You'll see that I've done a previous video on Network Day formula. And the difference between Network Day and Network Days formula is that for Network Day, it calculates the date, the number of days, sorry, between two dates. But if the start date is on either a Saturday or a Sunday, it will actually add one day to the result. With network days, that doesn't happen. So what you can do is just say equals network days. You highlight the start column, put a column, uh, comma, sorry, and then you put the end date press return and they have 40 days you can make that into a column form if you wanted to one of the things that network days can also do as well as network day but in this case network days is if you have a holiday so if I have a holiday so for example within here it can either be a bank holiday or a day that I'm not available for example um, so if I just put a day in there um, to say it was a bank holiday on the, on the 3rd of May so I can put that in there, and then what I can do is actually put the holiday in there if I wanted to. Um, so if I just put holiday, and then just put at row, you can see it's changed to 39 because it's taking into consideration that day. However, if I have a list of days, um, of holidays that I want to take consideration, I can just use um, the reference another sheet. So if I then reference another sheet, got this set up already just highlight my days in here insert the reference just press return you can see that it's gone to 38 days and that's because during that um, that range there are two holidays that we have here in the UK so if we just then make that a column formula you can see that we've now calculated the number of working days between these two dates, taken into consideration any holidays that you've identified. So there you have it, using Network Days formula to calculate the working days between the start and end dates, and taking into consideration any holidays that you might have identified. Thanks for watching, and for further details on our free and paid Smartsheet training courses, please visit the training and events section on our website at www.cheetahtransformation.co.uk. Alternatively, contact us directly on help at cheetahtransformation.co.uk to arrange a call to discuss your requirements further.